Hey guys, Dave here with you with Reverie Customer Service. We're gonna show you today how to troubleshoot your 208 Reverie Control Box. Now, as you see here, we have an adapter that's plugged directly into the wall. If you follow this cord, you'll see an adapter. It kind of looks like a laptop charger. You see that green light on there? That is a good sign. That means you're getting electricity. Now, when I unplug this from the wall, you'll see that light will slowly dim. That means you do not have any power. So you wanna make sure that's plugged into a direct wall connection or a surge protector with at least 600 joules. So I'm gonna plug this directly into the wall. Now, if you're looking for that control box, if I'm standing at the foot of the bed, it's gonna be on your right side if you're standing looking at the headboard. So you can see that control box underneath. If you come where the foot is at, you'll see it all the way in the center of the bed there. You see a white light there. I'm gonna go on the side here and show you where that's located. So if I'm coming underneath here, there's a white light here. Now, the way to pair that, if you look on our website, it'll show you, but just for purposes here, we'll push that button in for three to five seconds and then hit any button on the remote. You see that blinking. To do a hard reset, however, what you're gonna to wanna to do, this is important, you unplug it from the wall, that way there's no electricity coming to the bed. Come over here to the control box. You wanna make sure that you can get to that power cord here, that adapter, so trace that cord. Trace that cord all the way underneath. You'll see it's plugged in right here. That cord traces all the way underneath. Unplug that from the wall, unplugged from the control box. Now I can plug this in back to the control box, trace the cord over to the wall and plug it back in to the wall. 